Pattadakallu, a World Heritage Site in North Karnataka, is famous for its Chalukya Pirad temples. Pattadakallu, along with Aihole and Badami, became major cultural center for architectural innovation during 7th and 8th century Chalukya Pirad. There are 10 temples in Pattadakallu, of which eight are clustered in a single complex. Four temples are in South Indian Dravidian style and remaining four are in North Indian Nagara style. All temples are dedicated to Lord Shiva. This is a small but elegant North Indian Nagara style temple of Jambulingeshwara built around 1600 years ago. This is Galaganatha temple. It had a very big Sabagraha, only the platform remains and also a passage for Pradakshina. It was also built around 1600 years ago. This is Sangameshwara temple built around 720 AD, a Dravidian style temple with inscriptions in Kannada of the patrons and donors. I was impressed by the excellent pillared Sabagraha of this temple. Dravidian style Malikarjuna temple is bigger, more elegant than the previous temples. It was built around 740 AD, has excellent carvings of Ramayana, Mahabharata and Panchatantra. Virupaksha temple is the most sophisticated temple in the complex. It was built around 740 AD. It was built to commemorate the successful campaign of King Vikramaditya against Pallavas. It has many inscriptions in Old Kannada, mainly about the main architect and other artisans. World famous 
Kailasha temple at Ellora was modeled after this Virupaksha temple while this temple itself is modeled after Kanchi Kailashnath temple. Pattadakallo, situated on the banks of river Malaprabha, is unique. The temples here have influence of both North Indian style and South Indian style. This shows there was close interaction and exchange of ideas between North and South India. Please do visit this place to appreciate the architectural beauty and engineering marvel of these temples.